Hello, my name is Sakis Spahos and in today's tutorial we are going to talk about client dashboard. So basically we are going to have a login button and then we will create a light box. So to get things started, I have created my login button and my light box. Our next step is to actually enable the client to actually log into his, to his dashboard. So for that we're going to use a service called Yod Form. You might you might have heard it. Okay, so we'll need to create a form with a single field. Now, when a client enters their email, we need the form to redirect the client to his dashboard. We can do this using Yod Form's conditions. You click here then we need to click change thank you page now our configuration will be something like that if email is equal to the value of my, our clients email which in this case I will go for example at example.com do redirect to URL after submission. Now in this URL we will need to put our client's dashboard URL. We have not created that yet so I'm going to put temp1 for temporarily. Now we save it. If email is equal to example at example.com redirect to our link. Now we need to click on publish platforms search for Wix copy the code you just need that an HTML code drag it here paste the code here and you're ready to go now when a client enters their email here they will the form will redirect them to the dust to their dashboard now we need to create that dashboard first. I have already created mine. Let me show you here. You just need to create a page, hit it from the menu, and place a password on it. Now that's my page. It's hidden. You can put password by clicking here, permissions, password protection. For this example, we're going to use one, two, three, four. On this page you can have pretty much everything you like. I did it, uh, I put notifications, uh, invoices, amount due, which he can choose to pay instantly from the website. Uh, upload files to the designer so you can have access to them. For example, when a client needs to send some files to you, he can just log into his dashboard, add a file and then you can have access to it like that. So yeah, that's the basic idea. Now we need to get the link of this page. So we will have to make it visible again, just for a little bit. We'll publish it. Now really fast, we're going to take the URL of the actual page. Uh, this is a page. We're going to put the password. All right. That is our URL. We need to put it on the conditions. Edit. We'll need the to be redirected here. So we'll save this. If email equals to to our client's email, redirect to our client's dashboard. You will need to do that for every client. Create, um, I mean, create a page for each client and create a condition for each client. Now, when someone enters an email that you have not made a condition for, this is what it will tell you. Please check your email and try again. If you can log in, please contact us. Wrong, again, wrong email, try again. 
this is a Kushtil message. I created it. You can change it here by clicking the thank you and writing everything you want. This will only be shown when uh, the client enters an email that you have not made a condition for. If you have made a condition for, it will redirect the client to his dashboard. So let's try this live. Uh, let me just publish it to be sure. All right. So, oh, wait a second. All right. So we're on our website's homepage, and our client clicks client login, enters his email. It's in this tutorial we're using this because we have made a condition for it. And now it redirects us to our... So this is pretty much it. You can put everything you want, anything you want in this, uh, in this page. I don't think there is an easier way to do this. Wix does not have an official way to do this. So you have to work around it like that. I hope in the future this will change, but till then, I think this is the best choice for now. Thank you for watching.